Hello everybody, it's still Wednesday and as I said I'd be going to Iceland today, well I didn't know if I would but my bag it was enough, good enough to go so I've got a ridiculously huge haul here, I did not expect to spend as much, I expected to spend £20 but yeah, but this is like over a month's worth of stuff for the kids, they eat separately to us a lot of the time, Oscar will eat happily anything with us but Alfie is really really fussy, um, so not a lot I can do about that. We encourage him to try new foods and that's all we can do. So yeah, and there's some bits in for us as well because sometimes with my back at the moment it's hard to just get a meal out and Oscar's waking up in the night as well and stuff. Yeah, anyway, <laughs> I'm waffling so let's just get into it. So we got some tortilla wraps, um, some golden drummers and some turkey kiev. They were two for three pounds. Um, we got a big bag of banisters, um, ready baked potatoes. We buy them all the time. They're only three pounds for eight. Bag of hash browns corn and chicken and sweet corn pizza they're only a pound some milk lollies and some mix max chocolate cake things and um, two um garlic breads got some less quick for the kiddies um ten chicken burgers for the kids i'll feature these seven fried chips Two so apples pie, they'll be for Simon. Simon chose some cherry baked wells. I got these Linda McCartney vegetarian sausages. I love these. I don't know why, I just really, really like them. So I've got them and I'm pretty sure Oscar will like them too. Um, I've got some thick Irish pork sausages. I'm losing my words a lot today. It's been a long day though. Um, yeah, so I got those for the kids and us if we need them, but I generally buy lower fat things for us over that um and two garlic and herb chicken kiefs yeah i know there's more this is ridiculous Let's see what my kids are doing a second what's going on in here oscar Ann. <gasps> there he is he's trying to escape anyway back to the food hall so again for the kiddies 60 chicken dippers as I said this lasts so long and it's so much cheaper than buying all the bits from Tesco because that's what I've done the past couple of times it's just stocked up from Tesco but it doesn't last as long um, unless you get the good deals on things and you can't get as big a bag so yeah that's why I do that contradicting itself here a little isn't it um, some Slim and World burgers which we love and some minted lamb quarter pounds of sweat them braiders so you know got to treat yourself once in a while and um, some bake yourself um Home baked Yorkshire's, um, a stuffed pork loin joint. I wanted something different. This was on offer for three pounds. Um, I got two of these sausage and egg muffins. Um, Simon obviously picked up some cream to go with his cakes. Um, Buenos were like three for a pound. Bourneville is a pound. It's my absolute favourite. You can't get it very many places. Um, Got these for the kids again. I spent some love for you. Uh, Bubblegum and candy floss. Not had them before. Hopefully they're nice. Um, again, Nutella for the kiddies. I say for the kiddies. Totally going to eat as well, more than likely. Um, Alfie actually requested these. They're bake yourself croissants. I have no idea what they're like. They were quite expensive. They were two twenty five. So who knows? We'll see. I guess. Um, I didn't even pick this up. Stuffed crug. Crug. Stuffed crust. Chili beef hot dog stuffed crust. Okay, guess that'll be adding or something. Uh, some buttered onion rings. Um, again, these are two for three pounds, so I got turkey drummers. I thought I'd got two packs of them, and then turkey chips, but that's okay, they like them both. Um, I wouldn't normally buy this, but again, we haven't had fish for ages, and again, it's a quick and easy grab for me in the freezer. Um, so, six butter white fish portions and 12 cod fish cakes again a lot of this if the kids completely run out then we, I use their, ours as well so I can always just give them one of them and it'll be fine so yeah um 35 breaded fish fingers again for the kid only two pounds like so again um Alfie chose these as well crisscross fries they were only a pound I adore these sweet potato fries they were two pound but sometimes you just gotta do it and ate some fried breast sticks I think they were two pounds for those which I thought was amazing because you paid two pound for four in Tesco or two pound for six or something like that. I know, oh, three pounds. I'm really not sure. I can't remember. Um, but yeah, so I got those again as a keep in the freezer for us. And because obviously it's Easter, hot cross bun there for the kids will love that. So yeah, this is my second shopping haul of the day. I'll probably put them up on separate days if I even get them up tonight. But um, yeah, we've got all that over there. 
and then all of that over there. So no review, and that was £72.35 altogether. So somehow now I've got to figure out how the hell I'm going to get this all in my freezer. Awesome, yeah. So if you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you again next time. Thank you guys, bye! Hey everybody, it's Sammy again. Again, as I said last time, it is the same day as I filmed my last. Um, Tesco haul this morning, because my test came this morning and then we popped out to us in this afternoon. Um, I got way more than I expected and actually I expected to spend £20 and I spent 72 My freezers are ram jam packed. I'm telling you, I have, we have two freezers. We have a, like a big American style fridge freezer and then we have a chest freezer for the kids stuff as well. And obviously, like I said in the video, um, a lot of the stuff we buy monthly for the kids from there because it's just so much cheaper. But we've got a lot for ourselves this time as well and I'm just going to quickly show you an overview of my freezers. There with me one second. I was reading the words and pictures and stuff. Um, but yeah, this is my freezer. This is where I keep all my meats that I've separated. So I've got some chicken breast up there, some mints, some chops, and some more mints there as well. Look, I've made sure that it's still clear that's the air we can come through. We've got all the kids' ice lollies and stuff in here. I've got more chicken in here, and then I've got more ice lollies down there. Um, the way I organise my freezer is I'll put all potato stuff in here, then my meats in here, and then. Um, Second meats or as I can see in there, breads and extra meats this time and that's a stew that I have frozen. Um in here I have some like I used to keep veg and rice and stuff like that in here. Some random burgers. And then I have my veg in there and I have rams now as well. Because it is just absolutely ram jam packed. My fridge is really full today as well actually. Like ridiculously full. Obviously you can see that um shelf's a little bit more empty our friend lives with us so he has his own shelf and stuff um i'll quickly show you boys for excuse my mess look ram jam packed again at the top i have all their meats and stuff here this is actually again as i say our friend's um section but i uh, quickly check out his thingies in there um i uh, ram our pizza in there but i'm pretty sure the kids will eat this actually and then there's loads of other stuff in there as well um, and then the bottom drawer is just again ram jam drawer this time. So yeah. Excuse my crazy hair, it's just been one of those days. Um, but yeah, I'm just so glad that I actually managed to get it all in. Um, and the threes I did throw away a few bits and a few little bits of bottles, but nothing crazy. So yeah, again, massive thank you for watching. If you'd like to give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you again next time.